Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with my June wax empties. Um, and I got some obviously some uh, couple household empties as always. Um, but I got a couple half empties as well that I'm just going to include real quick. First up is Some Like It Hot. This is Suntan Lotion Coconut and Tropical Fruit from that Smuggle Shop. I really like this set. However, it wasn't that strong for me surprisingly. I really picked up on the um, little bit of the tropical fruit and um, the suntan lotion, which I love suntan lotion in wax. Um, so I enjoyed this one. I just wish it was a little bit stronger, which is surprising because usually her wax is super strong for me. Um, so there's that one. Next one here is Beach Night. I think the next time I melt this, I'm going to blend these two together like melt this in one warmer and this in another and see I feel like they'd go really well together so this is Fireos Marshmallow Sea Salt Breeze and S'mores um this one is pretty good um I would say this one is pretty slightly slightly similar to Sassy Girl Aromas Beach Nights it's not to me, it's not the dupe for um, Bath and Body Works, but it is kind of similar. So I, I like this one. I would definitely order that Beach Nights again. The next one is Key Lime Kokomo from Rose Girls. Key Lime Pie, Rainbow Sherbet, Saltwater Taffy Vanilla Ice Cream. This one I got April in April of this year. And this one was pretty good. However, again, this isn't the strongest scent, which is surprising because key lime pie is usually pretty strong so i'm gonna let this cure for a little bit longer and then test it out again um yeah i got it in april so like two months it's been curing almost yeah like two months so um i'll test it out again for sure so i'll just stick those off camera Next one is Doomsday from Super Tarts. This is plum, iced tea, and lemon. I did two cubes, and I love this scent. This is one of my favorites from um, Super Tarts, but yeah, if you like London tea and lemon from Bath and Body Works, I feel like you would like this one. It does have the iced tea and lemon note, obviously, but it does have the additional plum, which I love so if you like plum and London tea and lemon it's kind of like that London tea and lemon mixed with plum so it's really really good I love this um and the last half empty is tie-dye towels from Yummer's Delight this is volcano summer rainstorm and salty sea air I melted two of the like little starfish shapes in here and this is really nice very pretty refreshing scent I like to melt this like on a hot day or maybe like a super rainy day cozy you know um so yeah i definitely want to cut into this unicorn because it definitely has blue inside which i'm excited to cut into it and then melt it because it's going to be super pretty but yeah all right so those are my half empties now let's get into my actual empties i have two um two things of jumbo cotton balls here these are the walmart equate brand 200 count um i usually go through a bag whole bag in a month um but there's two bags here so this was from june no may there was like a half a bag so a bag and a half usually eh, so yeah all right i have a zinc here i always show these my zinc chelate i have a hand soap from bath and body works in rainbow cereal i think i got this last year at semi-annual sale this one is if we can get a fruity cereal crunch and a splash of milk this definitely smells like kind of like fruit loops fruity pebbles and definitely sugar milk i have one more in my collection i love that I have a native deodorant here in sweet peach and nectar this one is okay it's not my favorite scent i probably wouldn't get this one again um i really like their blackberry i think it's green tea and blackberry or something like that um i have a 
pocket back from Bath and Body Works and Fresh Sparkling Snow I used up. Love those. I think there's another one in here somewhere. Now I'm not going to be able to find it. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I think that's all the stuff, household empties I went through. Not too much. I don't show everything, but... All right, let's do clamshells. This is Better Homes and Gardens Whipped Vanilla and Blackberry. Love this scent. I have another one in my collection. This is such a pretty, like, mixed berry scent. It, but, yeah, it was a good throw as well. I went through Sweet Candied Apple. I had two cubes left. I have, I think, two more of these in my collection. I adore this scent. Um, I honestly hope they bring this back this year for Christmas time. This is such a pretty, very sweet, slightly cinnamon spiced um, candy apple. Like it definitely smells like a cinnamon candy apple from the fair. It's so, so good and it's so strong too. All right, I have lemon raspberry donuts. I really like this one. This is so nice. Um, mm, it's so yummy. You get the lemon, the raspberry, and that bakery note. Um, wasn't the strongest, I would say a medium performance, but it was long lasting for me. So I have another one of that in my collection as well. Um, flowering pink pineapple. This one, I am not the biggest fan of this one on warm. It definitely made me nauseous. This is pretty good throw as well. I would say meat to medium strong performance, um, but it does have a tartness to this, slightly tart sourness to it that I don't really care for. Um, so I'm glad I only got one. I wouldn't repurchase that one. Um, trying to find all my clamshells, okay. Next is Frosted Pineapple Cupcakes. This one, again, I wouldn't repurchase this one. I'm glad I only bought one. To me, it smells very artificial pineapple coconut, like a artificial pineapple coconut air freshener with a little bit of bakery, which I don't care for at all. So uh, it was a medium performance, but again, I wouldn't pick this one up. I have Plumeria Waters, also from Sensationals. This one I love. I have another in my collection. This is absolutely beautiful. It's floral, but it also leans laundry to my nose. Um, this definitely smells like, like a fabric softener to me. Like a pretty floral, super sweet fabric softener. And I love it. Very strong performance, long lasting. This is two days going in my warmer and I still smell it. So I have another one in my collection and I did see it at Walmart when I went the other day. Um, southbound, we have Wild Banana Birthday, Wild Berry Cookie Dough blended with delicious banana pudding and birthday cake. This one, this is definitely a low to low medium throw. I don't really care for her scent shots because they smell very plasticky on cold. Um, but that plastic note to me, um, sorry, I feel like I'm saying to me, to me a lot, but I mean, I don't want to, you know, but yeah, it's the plastic note transfers in my opinion to warm on cold. I got like Wildberry banana with a little bit of a plasticky note with this one. I'm gonna try my other clamshells because I do have some fall scents in South Mound in clamshells and see how those perform. If I still get that plasticky note, I won't be buying her clamshells anymore. This one, like I said, was a definitely light to light medium throw. So that was kind of disappointing. I thought this one was gonna be a lot stronger because it is banana in Wildberry, which tend to lean more heavy or strong performance wise, but yeah, I, I wouldn't repurchase that one. 
Um, next is Yummer's Delight Clamshell. This is Cheesecake, I'm sorry, with the cereal, which is Cheesecake, Sugar Cookie, and Fruit Loops. I really enjoyed this one. It was a medium throw. Uh, very heavy on the Fruit Loops, but you do get that creamy, sweet note from the Cheesecake and Sugar Cookie. I just wouldn't purchase, purchase this one again. Um, I probably would purchase it in a smaller size, but it's just like a sweet Fruit Loop scent, so yeah. Um, the performance was really well. It was like a medium to medium high throw. Another one from Yummers, Berries and Bedrock, Captain Crunch Berry Cereal and Zucchini Bread. I love this scent so much. One of my favorites. It is like basic, you know, because it's just Captain Crunch Berry and Zucchini Bread basic type scent but I love it so much such a strong thrower in my home great performance definitely um high performance as well it's so so good you get both of the Captain Crunchberry and Zucchini Bread very equally such a good bakery blend I have like I think I have two more in clamshells of these and I got, when did I get this? 2022, February of 2022 and March of 2022. Oops. All right, I think that's all for the clamshells. Oh, no, we got one more. Oh, two more, sorry guys. Uh, Southbound Fruit Loop Milkshake. This is Fruit Loop cereal blended into a delicious, cool and creamy vanilla milkshake. Again, I get a little bit of that plasticky note. However, this one didn't transfer too warm with that plasticky note. So that's a good thing. But this one I would say was a medium throw, which is surprising because of the Fruit Loops note, but I enjoyed it. Would I repurchase it? No, because it is just like a vanilla Fruit Loop scent. Um, Last clamshell is Yummer's Delight in Lemon Dump Cake, Lemon Whoopie Pies, White Cake, and Vanilla Custard. This one I did not like. I'm sorry. I love this company, but this Lemon Whoopie Pie fragrance oil I did not care for. It definitely leaned cleaner lemon instead of like a sweet bakery lemon. This is a harsh, like very tart, citrus, cleaner lemon. Um, yeah, I, I would not repurchase it just because it leaned cleaner lemon to my nose and the white cake and vanilla custard didn't save it for me. So I would pass on that one. Um, we have a little wax tub here from Silkies. This was from September of 2021. This was a custom sweet lavender, vanilla bean oil, butter mint, cotton candy frosting. Um, I finally started to melt this one. Um, probably the beginning of this year I let it sit because in 2021 of like what was it November of 2021 I ended up getting COVID and that's when my scent went and I couldn't smell anything for like a month and a half um, and then when I started to get my smell back mint started smelling nasty to me so I couldn't melt this because it has that butter mint in it but now mint is smelling normal to me again which only took like what almost two years um so i'm happy to be able to finish this such a great custom i love this very relaxing um i would definitely get this scent again all right let's do some scent shots here right. a couple scent shots from yummer's delight we have strawberry lemon sorbet, which is zesty lemon, zesty iced lemonade, and no, zesty iced lemon and strawberry soda. There we go. This one smells all right on cold. However, it was very, very light. So I would not repurchase this one again. California Girls, which is sunflower, salty sea air, and orange blossom. I have this scent in another scent shot. And I have this in her room spray. Love this scent. Excuse me, my throat. Um, really good performer. I would say medium to high. Uh, very sweet, floral, salty sea air. Very, very pretty. Love this. 
um, Malibu Barbie, which is Dole Whip Tangerine Gelato Whipped Cream and Sherbet Icing. This one was pretty. It wasn't the strongest, but it's it's really nice. Uh, you really get that tangerine and Dole Whip and warm. Um, yeah, I like this one. I'd say it was a medium throw. Twisted Pretzel, which is Baked Pretzel, Cherry Marshmallow, and Cherry Frosting. I love this. Such a strong performer. Um, you get the cherry icing, and then you definitely get that super bakery, kind of salty, yeasty pretzel. Mm, but that cherry note is really strong. So you definitely have to like cherry for this because it does have cherry frosting and cherry marshmallow. Um, so love this. Really good performer. S'mores by the Sea, which is graham crackers, gooey roasted marshmallow over salty sea spray. This one was a medium performer. You definitely get the everything. <laughs> it's gooey, it's sweet, it's salty sea air. This smells exactly like L3 Waxy Wonders Beach Nights. Because I have that in a scoopable. I have two scoopables of that and it smells exactly like it. So L3's does not remind me of Bath & Body Works Beach Nights at all. It's definitely heavy salty sea air. Um, so if you like L3 Waxy Wonders Beach Nights, you will definitely like S'mores by the Sea from Yummers Delight. Last one from Yummers Sun Shots is Spin Cycle. This is fluffy towels in blue sugar and boy oh boy, this is a really strong thrower. Man, I love this scent so freaking much. I have another um, Sun Shot in my collection and if you like blue sugar in like clean laundry, you will love this. This is an amazing, amazing performer. Blew me out of the house. It's one of my favorite scents from her for sure. All right. And then now we just have bags left and we will be done. I have a tiny, um, well, what is it? A fragrance oil refill from Walmart. I put this in my upstairs. This is Marigolds and Mums. Really, really strong. All right, let's do some Silkies. I have a lot of hers because I do her um, monthly wax melt challenges. So I go through a lot of her wax because she. I have a lot in my collection from her. So let me put all these kind of together. Yeah, I have a lot from her. Holy moly. Alright, I think that's all the silkies. So let's run through this real quick. Pumpkin pecan waffles, waffle cone, vanilla lace birthday cake. Beautiful. This was in a donut shape in one of her bakery samplers. Bakery donut shape samplers. Love this. Such a pretty scent. I would never think to mix pumpkin pecan waffles or pistachio pudding cake, sorry. Pistachio pudding cake with vanilla lace. Beautiful combination, beautiful. Great thrower as well. Blackberry, wildberry, I'm sorry. Blackberry, wild blueberries, cupcakes to Tiffany's. This is, wild blueberries is a new oil she started carrying and it is amazing. Um, love this, I would definitely get this again. Barbershop, super strong thrower. Smells like, uh, you know, shaving cream. Love it, very fresh and clean. Blueberry ice cream, I'm, I, oh my gosh. Blueberry ice cream cheesecake. I'm actually melting this in my bedroom right now and it is throwing like crazy. It's definitely coming out of my bedroom into other rooms and beautiful. Love that, I would get that again. That was a free sample that she sent me. Chocolate orchid, chocolate lavender, chocolate sugar cookie, um, butter cookie, beautiful scent. Love this. I would get this again. All right, I think these ones are all customs. Yeah, these are all customs I did. 
So blueberry muffin, peanut butter cookies, vanilla ice cream, delicious bakery scent. Golden Grahams, Count Chocula, Marshmallow Fluff. I probably wouldn't get this one again just because it wasn't my favorite. Peanut butter cookies, brownie batter, salted caramel pretzel. I love this. I would definitely get that again. It's salty. It's sweet. It's gooey. Love it. Vermont maple syrup, southern pecan pie, ice cream scoop red, vanilla ice cream. Definitely would get this again. Very heavy on the southern pecan pie and Vermont maple syrup. Very like thick and sweet scent. Awesome performance. Sweet on Paris, boardwalk marshmallow clouds, pink sugar. Very girly, very pretty, and that's what I wanted, and that's what I got. Strawberry cheesecake, blackberry jam butter cookies, saltwater taffy. This one, I probably wouldn't get it again. Just not a big fan of her saltwater taffy. Strawberry cheesecake, French toast whipped cream. I'm so glad to be done with this. I am not a huge fan of this one. The strawberry cheesecake just smells a little artificial to my nose. It's not my favorite strawberry in this, so I wouldn't get that one again. Though I do have another brittle of it that I want to work through and get rid of um, this month. Well, in the month of July. So... Next one is mango sorbet, exotic coconut, pineapple whip, salty sea air. I would definitely get this one again. I love the combination of pineapple and salty sea air or fruit and salty sea air. So this one I loved. All right, we got three here from Little Blue Coop. I wanted to finish this company up. I think I have, do I have one more thing or did I finish it all? I think I finished all my stuff from her. Yeah, I think so. Okay, Sweet Dreams. This was like a sweet lavender and like vanilla marshmallow scent. Loved it. This one I would repurchase. Very, very pretty. Pretty good for performance as well. I would say a medium to medium high throw. This one was a very strong thrower for me. I'm not the biggest fan of Fizzy Pop, but I did like it in this blend. So this is Pink Lemonade and Fizzy Pop. Awesome scent throw. I would, I would get this one again, surprisingly. Um, blackberry taffy, blackberry jam, cotton candy, saltwater taffy. I would not get this one again just because it was on the light to light medium performance. So just because for that, I want something stronger in that this didn't give me. So I would not repurchase. A couple things from Yummers. We had a little sample in blackberry scones and oh my gosh, this was phenomenal. Such, this was like in a little pusheen cat and it was such a great thrower. Um, mm, I would get her blackberry scones by itself. Very sweet, I really like that black blackberry. This one here was in a little milk bottle shape. This is Unicorn Tears Cotton Candy Frosted Cake, Ice Cream Scoop Bread, and Marshmallow Peeps. This one was good, I would say it was a medium performer, which is, like I said, surprising being it's, you know, cotton candy, marshmallow, but ice cream scoop bread is a pretty strong performer for me. I could still smell it in the bag. I love her cotton candy. Her cotton candy oil is definitely my favorite for sure. I would get that again. We had a brittle in hard eyes, which is strawberry white cake and blueberry cobbler. This one was a medium thrower for me. I wish it was a little bit stronger, but I liked what I got from it. Would I repurchase it again? No, probably not. I have a bakery bag and from Silkies. I forgot about this. Marshmallow, marshmallow, maraschino cherry, Palo Santo, sweet bakery dough. This is a custom from 2021. This threw amazing. Love this scent. I'm so sad to be out of it. Definitely need to order more of this because this is amazing. I love cherry blended with Palo. And then you add that sweet bakery dough. It's phenomenal. Love it. Such a strong performer as well. And then the last two here are from Bodies Harmony, which were from her like Valentine's kind of Disney lovers collection. So we have Anna and Kristoff, which is white cake, cotton candy, frosting, strawberry crunch, vanilla be Noel. This smelled like those strawberry, like those good humor strawberry crunch ice cream bars. Oh my gosh, this was a good melting day. Such a strong strong performer and I wish she was still open well she's closing soon but I would love to get this again 
but I know I can't. But I'm in, I'm glad I melted it and enjoyed it when it still performed. Such a great performer. Awesome scent. And last but not least is Rapunzel and Flynn Rider, which is Fruity Pebbles Strawberry Jam Sugar Cookies. This is beautiful. Very heavy on the Fruity Pebbles. I didn't really smell the Strawberry Jam. Maybe like a Fruity Pebble Sugar Cookie scent, but good performer as well. And that is it for my June wax empties. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm so sorry I talked. I feel like I talked too long. Um, <coughs> I talk so long my throat is starting to go. But anyway, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Um, Fourth of July is coming up. Have a wonderful, safe, 4th of July weekend. If you're doing anything fun, me and my boyfriend are probably just going to stay home because we like the quiet indoors. <laughs> um, so yeah, enjoy your weekend, stay safe, um, and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys!